Now joining us in studio to talk briefly about the Calypso season is Steve Etienne, the general manager of ECHO, the Eastern Caribbean Collective Organization for Music Rights. Steve has been at uh, most of the tents and to all the quarterfinal shows and shares his thoughts both in the capacity of ECHO as general manager and as a Calypso fan. I'm always wearing my ECHO hat mm. and um, our role is to collect royalties uh, for our members and royalties are, is dependent on play performances taking place. So performances in the tents, live performances, all effects, uh, and of course radio and television airplay. Yeah. And they're two different things. Mm -hmm. I could have a good laugh over a song, um, um, but it does not necessarily, I, I will know that, um, you know, based on instincts and, and my knowledge that that it will not go beyond those three weeks. Come Carnival Wednesday, that song will not be played. So is that a business model that can be developed that you, it's, it's a, or is it even a business model? Right. This is a short season that you have and so you try to maximize your economic returns from that short season. Does that make sense or do we have to start thinking of a I more think we need to think exportable, a more long-term product? Precisely. I think we have to look at it in two ways. First of all, um, doing something for pleasure, for fun and doing something to make money. Mm -hmm. And uh, if we're happy doing things for fun and have a good time, that's okay if you do not expect to make money, but don't do something for fun, for levity, uh, themes that will entertain, but not make you money and expect to make money. You know, you have to be, you have to be focused on what you want to do, what you want to achieve. Um, a performance on national radio stations in this, in this country is as little as 5% in royalties. Uh, that same one performance in the UK is beyond 25 pounds. So we're talking about, so where do you want to, to, to shop? Where do you want? Do you want some airplays during a two-week period? Or do you want something that can be played, that can be performed uh, in the larger markets, such as Europe, such as the United States? And if you want to be, uh, if you want the latter, which is, which is to be performed in all these places, then you, you need to look at your content, look at your product. You need to have a different perspective. You need to write the songs that will be attractive to that market.